Here comes the field for tonight's sixth race. Final leg of the early pick three, one Caddy's Orphan. Owned by Dorvin York, driven by Don Cromer. Two Millie's Bud Light, owned by Terry Gillen with David Miller. Three Katie's Noble Lady, owned by Wanda Everman with Herbie Brown. Four Shocking Sarah, owned by F. Batchy Jr., partnership of Farwick, Rogers, and Gilmore with Jody Yessig. Five is Albus Chance, owned by John Wolf, along with driver Roy Burns. Six Cincy Jackie, owned by Tom Price and Jeff Smith. Seven Hello Ashley has been scratched. Eight is delayed, owned by Ronald Barker with Brad Hanners. Nine Noble Lens, owned by David Warnstaff, driver change Justin Hall. Ten Special K May, owned by Mervyn Kinner. Brett Merker will be in the sulky. Scratch the seven off the program, Hello Ashley. Justin Hall will drive the nine. Field is now in motion. And there they go. They're off and pacing. Elvis Chance, middle of the racetrack, takes the lead in Millie's Bud Light. Here's Katie's Noble Lady up on the outside. Cincy Jackie on the far outside. They're scrambling now. On the rail, Caddy's Orphan is fifth. Quickly on the inside, shocking Sarah after that comes D Lane. Midway on the turn, special K May. And the trailer is Noble Lens. Battling for command and position of the opening quarter mile pole. Out on top, it's Elvis Chance in 29 and 1. Racing past the stands to the half mile pole. Driving away on top, it's Elvis Chance by a head. Ranging up on the outside, second and challenging Katie's Noble Lady. Underway, Cincy Jackie, Millie's Bud Light skimming the pylons in fourth. Caddy's Orphan set sail from the rail, biding her time, the favorite shocking Sarah. Delayed, special K May and Noble Lens. Action galore here. They're at the half mile pole in 58 and 3. They're out of the turn and down the backstretch. Elvis Chance trying to make every pole a winning one. The favorites are jammed up inside of her. Katie's Noble Lady is in the center. Millie's Bud Light is along the rail. Cincy Jackie driving wide and hard on the far outside. Far outside, Caddy's Orphan. Jody Essig eases shocking Sarah off the rail, and she's five deep as they side wheel into three quarters. With a rush on the far outside, Caddy's Orphan takes over. Not home free yet. Shocking Sarah picks up the chase. 129 and 2. Around the far turn. Caddy's Orphan on top. Shocking Sarah and her confident Hanley eases up on the outside second. A gap of five lengths to Cincy Jackie third. Looks like we're down to two, 16th of the mile of pace. Caddy's Orphan along the rail. Shocking Sarah still closing with every stride. She's getting the best of her. It's Caddy's Orphan along the rail, not good enough. Shocking Sarah under the whip is going to get it. Caddy's Orphan second, Cincy Jackie holds third. Scioto Downs here for the Jug Preview on Saturday the 6th. Tomorrow night we'll have the simulcast from Yonkers of the Kane Pace. The half million dollar Hoosier Cup from Hoosier Park. Many of these Colts will be here for the Jug Preview on Saturday the 6th of September. There's Jody Essig and number four, Shocking Sarah. Two-year-old Brown Philly by Look Sharp out of Hot Flash. Owned by Batchy, Farwick, Rogers, and Gilmore. Trained by Joe Essig. Hard driven by Jody Essig to cover the mile here in two minutes and two fifths and establish a lifetime best. Number four, Shocking Sarah, the winner. Post time at 9.33. Next post.